hello today we will see about creating views views are very important views are logical or virtual table it is a logical or virtual table which is based on the result set of the sql statement so it is a virtual table based on the result set of a sql statement for example suppose i have a table like this i have a table employee with employee id employee name and department this is a table and i have two different users user 1 and user 2 suppose user 1 handles department 10 and user 2 handles department 20 so now both the user user 1 and user 2 are accessing this particular table employee but since user 1 is handling department number 10 only he should not be able to see the details of department 20 he should be able to see the details of only this and this department this department and user 2 should be able to see the details of only this and this now using a table it is not possible one way of doing this is to create different tables but creating a table is not recommended because it takes physical space so what we can do is we can create views which are logical or virtual table which is based on the result set of a sql statement so for this i can create a view like this with the syntax create view then name of the view which can be department 10 view then use as select star from emp where department is 10 so this particular thing is the sql statement which i am talking about here this sql statement will return one result set which is having the data like this employee id employee name and department and the data will be only 1 a 10 and then 3 c 10 so this will be the result set and this result set will be present in the view department 10 view similarly i can create a view for this particular user just i have to change here 20 now user 1 should have access to this view only not the table suppose user 1 has access of selecting data from this view he can select data from this view so user will user 1 will type the command for like select star from now in, if now if the user 1 will write like this there will be a error because user 1 does not have access to fire select on this table so user 1 will fire only select star from department 10 view now if user 1 fire a query like this then he can see the records of only employees working in department number then similarly user 2 will fire a query and he can see only the records of employee working in department number 20 so this is how views are created in oracle database there are more options available for views that we will cover in the sql part of the database course currently for admin purpose or as a simple database administrative user you need to know why view should be created and by uh, when we are granting 
the privileges and roles then it must be kept in mind which user can see what data thank you